Hi, um, welcome to my channel. My name is Stacy, and I am so happy you're here, especially for this exciting video that um, I did. And it's an unboxing of what I bought in Black Friday and this makeup company called We Makeup. And it's an Italian makeup brand and I did purchase an eyeshadow palette. So if you like to see the shadows um, as far as swatches go and how they package the shipment for these and my wish list and this makeup look I did create with my custom palette. Um, keep on watching. I did discover this makeup brand from Amy Loves Makeup and it made me look into this brand during their sale. So I'll list the video down below of her having her own custom palette that she made and these shadows are stunning so um i could see why i was influenced to purchase these shadows because of amy so um please give her some love and um i hope you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already ring the bell and um yeah so without further ado let's get started So when I got this package in the mail the other day, I was not expecting it to arrive at my home because I did have a, a location set to pick it up at my local CVS. But I guess they decided to ship it here and it arrived completely intact. And this is what the box looks like. Outer part. Really, really cute. Um, and then in the back, it does have information um, in Italy here. And this is like the English translation. And I'll just read it real quick. It says, We have been in the cosmetic industry for over 50 years with a clear goal the best quality at wow prices. Color, customization, and performance to let you express your true self. Thank you for being part of our weekend. Made in Italy with love. So it's really, really interesting that this company is from Italy and that pretty much this is like a European cosmetic baseline and I love the concept of having makeup made in Italy that's like the same idea with Natasha Denona like her shadows are made in Italy but unfortunately they're really expensive so in the box it's almost really unique because you just slide it and this is where my product was at and it came with like these purp these uh purple <laughs> these paper like um packaging for the shadows not to break it was really well packaged and i would i feel like i would use this box for um like be gifting or something so the palette that i got contained 15 eyeshadows and different finishes so they each came in like a little um labeling and the shadow was inside here so i was able just to peel it off and then the shadow just came out very easily so but this was one of them and 
think that's really pretty to look at. And um, I will be entering all the swatches of the eyeshadows I got, so you'll see it right now. And they're interesting because all the shadows are labeled in numbers and they're through categories. So if you're getting a 300 number shadow, it's part of the 3D metal line. Um, same fourth with the 400s. Um, those are in categories of duochromes and so on and so forth. So I think that's a really organizing method of choosing what kind of eyeshadows you will like in your palette and yeah I think it's really really nice and on the website they also have these gorgeous lip products I really really wanted I really I was so tempted to get more besides the palette but I stopped myself because I already own too many lip products at this moment like it's kind of embarrassing because it's more than 10 and like to buy more without using those I feel like it's until next year for me to purchase their liquid lipsticks their lip glosses I mean they had so much good variety and I feel like like I just feel like it's in a great price and it's just on my wish list now <laughs> as far as that okay so now let's get into the palette and the palette is really really cute because it came in this sleeve and it says OMG it's just as good as they say we make up dot it and then in the back it says your custom palette um, made in Italy, not tested on animals. And it just comes out like that. <clears throat> so this is what my palette looks like. And it came with a Wii sticker so I just put it on my palette because it's so reflective and pretty <laughs> to look at. And it says so pretty eyes, so pretty eyes. It's a really great palette. Like this does not feel cheap. It feels like it's kind of heavy and it's so nice. Like in the back it says, hey, hashtag we girl. And as you can see, there's like little holes on the back of the palette, but that's just so you could insert a pin to take out your eyeshadow safely. And that's like the same idea for Natasha Denona. So I think that's really, really interesting. It's just like, hmm, I'm interested in picking up another palette, but um, I don't know, it's just really, really cool. Okay, so then this one has like a mirror. Um, it has a mirror and in it it says you are beautiful with a heart so that's super cute and then here are the eyeshadows that I picked up from my palette so I really want to create a pretty eyeshadow look using just this custom palette I made but um, I'm not sure what colors to go for okay so i think as a transition shade i'm going to take this pink shade right here on the corner and i'll just put that all over my lid for now
Okay, so now I'm going to be taking this shade right here, and it's like almost like a muted rose peach kind of flower. Um, I don't know if there's a rose color like that, but um, it's a pretty shade, so I'll put that on my outer crease, and I'll just kind of work it in with that pink. So now to finish off my crease look, I am going to be taking this beautiful lavender shade right here. That part right there. Um, and I'm just going to put it lightly as a light transition over everything I've done for my crease. So now I just blend everything together. So now that all my crease situation is all done, it's looking really pretty like the sunset. <laughs> um, now the fun part is putting on the lid sheet. And I really want to try out like these duochrome shades, but I don't think I'm going to be using all of them because my eye is just really like, I don't know, like I feel like it would be hard to fit everything in there. <laughs> um, okay, you know what? I think I'm going to go with a halo eye just so I can use two duochromes. So I think the first one I'm going to choose is this one right here in the corner. And I'm just going to put it as like this part, like this half, and then the other half on the end. And we'll go from there. Okay, so this is what the shadow looks like, and it's really beautiful. Um, it's got like sparkles in it, and it's really nice. Like, the shadow is almost like a creamy textured formula, but you can see the shift happening right there. It's like, it looks like it's got like green or blue reflect on it, and it's super beautiful. There's a middle part right here. Um, so the middle part, I'm going to be using this one right here, and it's almost like a like one of those classic shades from ColourPop, Glass Bowl, Sandy Grace's uh, Winter Garden, Sigma's um, Enchanted palette. I don't know the shade for that one, but it looks just like this. So I'll put that in the middle right here. So this is what the lid shades are looking like so far and it's really really beautiful once you have the patience to apply them. I could say that the formula is very creamy so you would have to make sure your brush gets in there to really apply it. Not, not so much pressure on your eye. But like on the shadow itself because it's so dense and like the formula is soft and cream-like 
then that's something you would have to keep in mind to do when you apply these shadows but they're really beautiful um as you can see uh, the shades do have a little bit of fallout um you can kind of see here okay so now in our corner So in our corner, I have a couple of options here to go with, but again, I'm not sure which one to choose. I could choose this light blue shade. I love blue shades. They're really stunning. And then this green one right here. I think to go with the sunset vibe, I'm going to choose this blue one right here. It's like a iridescent blue shade, so we'll see if this one's creamy. So this is my completed eye look. I really love all the shadows all together and the inner corner that I chose for um, this whole eye look to finish it. The only problem I'm having personally with not with in terms of these shadows because they all perform beautifully but I feel like it really affects the shadow performance if you have some sort of primer base before you start your eye look and I'm just starting to notice that using concealer and translucent powder is not the best method of applying eyeshadow and that's only because it emphasizes texture a lot and if I just simply use a Milani eyeshadow primer and a glitter primer, it does not do that at all. Like, it's such a difference because, like an example for my inner corner, you could see that there's like emphasized textured, like you see that? Like, that never happens to me unless I'm using just a normal primer but the only reason being I'm using concealer is just to use it up and I, I don't feel like I want to throw it away but um, that's just maybe a tip you could probably use if you don't want that happening to you <laughs> so I really really love the palette I created on my own I can't wait to see what this company comes out with in the future, especially new eyeshadows because these are stunning. Um, they have different options for palettes. They have one that's like a quad. Um, they have one that's like 50 eyeshadows, so it's like a huge palette. It doesn't come with all the eyeshadows they own but it pretty much covers like 95% of their collection so I really recommend that you try out this eyeshadow brand um, I think on your first purchase they do give you 10 euros which is $10 credit on your account and I believe it's only when you purchase from this month and then next year, you could use your 10 credit with um, the months from January to February, I believe. So I think it's a really cool concept. Like, you could use your credit and maybe they'll have a sale going on during that time. So I think that's like a win-win. I may pick up like their liquid lipsticks maybe more eyeshadows because I can't get enough of eyeshadows and based on from what I use from what I chose everything came out beautifully and yeah I, I highly recommend it so thank you
thank you thank you so much for watching if you did i hope you continue being safe um may god bless i hope you're enjoying your christmas season safely at home um watch christmas movies drink hot chocolate thank you again and i will hopefully see you in my next video bye